Dick Dickerson here reporting live for Farm Sim News. Welcome to the show. We'll be starting the stream soon, but first, a few tips to help make this the best stream for everyone. Number one, make sure you got some goodies to snack on. Water and popcorn is always recommended, but you can take that mild and turn it up to wild with a tall monster and a handful of Reese cups. You can be assured, DJ Goham will be enjoying something tasty as well. Number two, chat is rated PG, which stands for pretty good. And I stand for that, which is pretty good. Make sure to be respectful to yourself and others during the stream. Here at the Goham fam, we have a saying, ELE, everybody love everybody. All ages are welcome, and we love to have lots of interaction. DJ is very open and would love to chat with everyone. Feel free to post comments and questions during the stream. Number three. Chan is being monitored closely by our amazing channel moderators, who want the best for everyone. They're here to make sure the stream goes as smooth as possible so that we can all have a great time. These ladies and gentlemen are the best of the best, and we are very lucky to have each and every one of them. If you need help during the stream, their names are in blue, and we'll be happy to help if DJ is not able. And lastly, number four. I never really know what to say for the fourth option, so let's just assume that I've said something super intelligent and game-breaking. Now, no one can control themselves. It's like we've all had four shots of espresso and ate a whole box of Pop-Tarts, top of jelly, and spray butter for some unrelated reason. Or something like that. Yeah. If you're looking for links to other great YouTubers, maybe you want to buy a Get Out of Here Birds t-shirt. Or are curious on what kind of computer DJ uses for YouTube. You can find all that information in the description below. If you are already a member of the Goham fam, welcome back. I hope you enjoy the show. If you are a new member to the channel, hello and welcome. We love to have fun here and we are glad that you've joined us. If you are ready for the stream to start, drop a hashtag let's go in the chat box below. Sit back, relax, and we hope you enjoy today's live stream. Rich Dick Dickerson reporting live for Farm Sim News.
Oh, yeah, you know what time it is. It's Wednesday, it's stream day, and today we got something real exciting for you guys. We are going to be on White Bull Mining's new map, Richport. Today is the first look map tour, everything, number ones, episode one. I don't know. It is what it is. We're going to show you all the way around the new map. We're going to talk about it, tell you when you could expect it. Actually, I go and tell you. I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't know when it is. There's no release dates. I got nothing. <laughs> but it is uh, completed, or at least almost complete. I got a new version of it today. So we're playing on the newest version that they've sent over. I'm very excited to share this with you guys. Also, at the end of the live stream, we have something special from A2 Studio. Now, I imagine this is not going to be for anybody other than maybe me and one or two other people. But it is the toothpastest fastest thing I've ever seen in my life and I've been told I'm not allowed to use it until this until this stream so with all that being said we got a toothpaste tractor and let's give some shout outs to everybody hanging out in here with us the first shout out today obviously has to go to white bull modding you know it's going to white bull modding we got to man got to thank you I appreciate it I like this shirt it's pretty sweet uh we got daddy in here we've got JB pit barbecue we got them in here as well uh sparrow modding's been in here showing some ELE we got the dab on them with a2 studio what's up brother good to see you in here uh we're gonna be showing his mod here in about 40 minutes 45 minutes something like that Ben Carr always good to see you in here I hope everything is going well your way Neil B, we got Jameson Lyons in here, Robert Morris, Ted Lambert. How you doing, guys? Hey, 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 Farmer Luke is in here hanging out with us as well. FSG, strange talent. Hashtag <laughs> Ooh, we we'll get the hiccups. Drink a coffee. Got coffee today. That's my drink of choice. That and water. Say, Turk, how you doing, man? Good to see you. Did we just chat? Jeremiah Brown's in here with us. Let's farm it. Yeah, let's go farm all the things. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who else hanging out here with us? We got John Woolley in here. He's got a whole lot of ELE going on. We got Declan. How is everything going your way, Declan? Hope you are doing very well today. Alex Ward, much love, bro. Scott George, David C. Got all the cool people in here today. Yo, let's give like five more and then let's do some real cool stuff. Let's see. We've got KTM 65 live streams. Bet you won't pin this. You right. Uh, we got Josh in here as well. Tyler, Rolling Cold Customs. How are you doing today? Skipper, we got Marmic. And we've got Roman. I don't know how to see your last name. We got Roman. Jarl. And Thomas, of course. Thomas is always in here. Hey, Teddy Tiptree. I haven't seen you in a minute. Good to see you. Jameson Kalamaki, of course. Yo, big old shout out to Kalamaki. He dropped a super chat just to see if his debit card worked. <laughs> You're crazy, man. You're crazy, man. Yo, let's get right into it. How about that? Let's get out of here. Let's go over here. Oh, that's the wrong button. And let's go right here nitro dad how you doing man good to see you in here what is cracking i don't know anything about slot counts nothing like that i am on pc today um but this is all platforms so you guys are gonna see everything that i see all platforms could be yeah all right let's do it this is your main farm this is the main farm your uh you've got two entrances one entrance is all the way out here the other entrance will be on the other side show you the pda real quick here is your pda you've got everything going on here your main farm right here in the middle and that is what you start with you've got some strip farming to start with so you got a little bit of grass on the outside of it these are grass fields and then you have your little itty bitty fields outside of that so there you go you've got that you got cows oh yeah this this has been like the headlining feature of this map is the cow pen i love this cow pen setup this is going to be so cool for these of you guys that want to play a little bit more american maybe a little bit more i don't say realistic is the word but definitely a little bit more american you've also got an above ground slurry pit that will fill up you have right here where your manure is going to be dropping it's cool stuff uh jonathan no we don't know nothing about the snowmobile uh check farm some news if it ain't there well then ain't nothing going on with it there you go. How's about that? Let's go around a little bit more. We do have a silo right here. It is nice to see this silo right beside. I don't think this does anything, at least from what I've been able to see. But we do have this silo, and this is a big, big silo right here. Absolutely massive. Uh, no new mods dropped just a couple hours ago. It's the only ones, the normal ones. So we've got all this going on here. We do have this. Check this out. 
White Bull since 2016 Shed. Oh, now that I am excited about. You want to see a side of it? Let's drop down to the ground. Let's check it out on the inside. Boop. Open it up. Now, this is, I think, the slowest shed that I've seen. So we've got that through here. You've got a lift, which is nice. can't remember if it's that side or this side. There it is. This lift does work just like the mod that we got earlier today. Yeah. Yeah. You can walk under it, do what you want to do. And then when you're ready, break it back down. How cool is that? That is pretty darn cool. Let's show you around a little bit more. Just want to give you a basic overview. And then we are going to, woo. Then we're going to go take a look at each place little by little. This right here is another big shed. Does this come all platforms? All platforms. All platforms. Boop. So you've got all that. That's a straight drive through. Here's another set of sheds. You've got some nice decorations around. Uh, of course, there's some older stuff. You know, if you've got old stuff on your farm, you're just going to set it to the side. That's exactly the, the way they have decorated this. There is no question that this is an American farm. You got an American flag here. You've got an American flag on the silo over here. You got a whole lot of good stuff. All platforms, yes, kiddo. Of course. <laughs> you guys know I only show. Uh, I will. I will very un, or very likely not show any PC only maps. Um, that would just be rude. So you've got that those sheds right there. Humongo bunker silos right here. One of the cool things about these bunker silos is you could drive around to the back of them and then back up and dump in if you really want to. How's about that? Yeah. Now you do have this bad boy right here as well. Now this was one that I, I'm not quite sure, hay loft. Hey, so you could do hay right there. That's pretty cool. CP Gaming Mechanics says, hey, hey, hey. Send some Canadian love this morning. Let's get a shout out for CP Gaming right there. CP, thank you very much. That is real kind of you, bro. Good to see you in here. We've got another shed right here. This is another one of those drive-through sheds. So you're going to be able to put your like semi-trucks, things like that. It's very difficult to find a shed where you can like pull through like your big cedars, fertilizers, even planters you're seeing right here. That's so annoying. We're not going to play that one today. <laughs> so white bull here. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. So this is going to be one of those sheds that you could do all that with, which I am a huge fan of. But as far as the main farm virtually, that is about it. There's not a ton on the farm. However, everything is extremely useful. So uh, you could do that as well. Uh, let's see, uh, Mirren, we're only gonna be focusing on new farmer today. We'll save the rest of that stuff for once they've sent off this for testing. So that's your main farm. Now there are a few other places around this map. So let's check out our PDA see where we're at, and then see where we're going to be going. So right now we're right here. This is where our main farm is. Here is one little area of town. We have two areas of town, so we've got one there. We've got another one over here. Plus, we have some cell points that are kind of scattered around. These fields are massive, absolutely massive. One thing I did find, White Bull, if you are watching, is the pricing was a little bit off for this field. Uh, it's a little bit expensive. It's about a million dollars more than other fields at size. Figure I'll let you know. Dragon said 1970 dots up, DJ. You seem extra hype about this one. I like American maps. I like them, especially when you get to see them for all platforms. Yes, very, very cool. Here is your first of two town areas. Get not massive, but this is the one that's got quite a few of the things that you're going to want on here. For example, starting off, you have your animal dealer right here. Then if we go around, you have a cell point right through here. You've got other buildings around just for decoration. Kind of make it feel more alive, more, more flourishing, if you will. Right here, this is a screenshot that we saw just a few days ago. Actually, two days ago. Right here. That's going to be one of your uh, things right there. Fuel. Plus, you'll be able to buy uh, or get <laughs> buy money. <laughs> I guess you could buy money. Uh, my mouse is on the screen. Your mouse is on the screen. <laughs> of course, my mouse is on the screen. I'm doing a uh, screen capture right now. So I do two PC setup. You also have your sawmill right here as well. So logs, wood chips. It is nice that wood chips are around the back versus logs. You got big, big area right here. Now, why would you need such a massive sawmill? 
Anybody like doing logging? Anybody down for some logging? There's tons of logging and you can tell what the logging areas are by the areas here. So you can see all in orange, nice and easy. You shouldn't have to guess. You look at it and be like, oh, those are orange. Those must be where the trees are. And that's exactly where they're at. There's one area that you cannot buy. And that is this area up here. <clears throat> Excuse me. This is just for hanging out, checking it out. Uh, yeah, <laughs> you've got a waterfall right there. And you've got a nice little another American flag up here with a windmill and a radio tower. You've got all that right where you need it to be. It is a little bit difficult to get up here, so you're going to have to work your magic. Uh, it's I don't think it's meant to be gotten up there. It is meant to be looked at. So there you go. You've got that. Let's go back around. We've seen one town. Map from Raven. There's a couple things on here from Ravenport. Uh, but then again, there's a lot of maps that there's a couple things from Ravenport on. So let's take a look. We're going to go down to the bottom of the map now. We got Formal Pickle in here. Hope he's doing all right. When are you going to stream the charity stream? He has posted on his social medias when those are going to be. Formal Pickle, how are you doing, man? Much love, bro. Hope everything's going well your way. This is your second area right here. Now, it may look like there's a bunch going on, but actually, there's not a whole lot going on right here. It's all four kind of hanging out, role play, you know, coming in here and say, uh, ooh, ooh, hang on, let me, let me practice my role play. Oh, hang on, hang on. Well, we just got done eating dinner at the uh, diner here, and uh, let's let's go back home or something. So this is why I don't do role play. That was real bad. <laughs> hey, Forble Pickle, everything's going good this way, man. Everything is great. You've got some areas around where they look to be building house. What can I do for you? Shut up, Google. <laughs> you guys hear that? That's awesome. So you've got all kinds of stuff around through here. I do like this uh, kind of the, the, the decoration. We see the farmhouse. Not, I mean, yeah, we'll get there. I got you. Hold tight. We're going to go everything in detail. We're doing the overview right now. But you've got stuff through here. Now, what exactly is down here? Not a whole lot. You've got a cell point, and you have your horse farm. That's about it. You got another place to do uh, stuff down there. If this is your horse farm, we'll come down. Check this out. White Bull Modding Ranch. Oh, that's so cool. This is going to be for your horses right through here. You got a nice uh, horse barn. Let's see. Any of the doors open? Not likely. Yeah. So that is where your horses are going to be. You have a nice little riding area right here as well. So you've got that if you wanted all kinds of stuff. <laughs> Can we get a shut up, G-O-O-G-L-E in the chat? Oh, man. Uh, you guys know I love bridges. So it is nice to have bridges on here. We've got a couple of them. I know there's one there. There's another one over here. So it is are things that kind of break up the monotony of just flatlands and straight roads. And, of course, more American flags if you needed any more guidance on if this was an American map or not. Couple places around. Your store's gonna be down here. This is a John Deere dealer. So those of you that are green fans, well, this is going to be just for you guys right here. No release dates. No release dates on literally anything. Uh, over here, let's drop down to the ground and let's take a look inside here. Once we see this, we're gonna go back over to the main house. There we go. Oh, we should probably slow down a little bit. How fast are we running right now? Eight times the end game speed? <laughs> let's slow that down. How about that? So let's check it out in here. Now this is one neat thing. Here, open the door. Come right inside. Get our vehicles, anything like that. Let's see about a little John Deere. How about that? Where is it? <laughs> I could have swear I installed it. Yeah, here we go. We got a couple. Actually, you know what? Let's go with J or a uh, JA Modding's John Deere. We'll go ahead and lease that. We'll figure out where it is. So once you buy, it's going to plop you right back outside. Now you see this? This is the in-game 9R. Can you drive it? Or 8R, sorry. Nope. Can't drive it at all. Can't pick it up, throw it, nothing like that. But it is solid. So keep that in mind. Otherwise, nothing else really in here. You got a couple little things hanging out here and there, but there's not a whole lot going on in here. Let's head outside. <laughs> That's only in small tractors. So this is where your vehicles are going to spawn outside right here, which is very nice. Let's take a look. Can we open these bad boys? This is where you're going to be working on your vehicles. 
Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Well, that, that one. There we go. We've got all that going on. Got a nice little showcase right here. What do you guys think? Pretty cool. Actually, this right here, this would be nice to replace with the model that we got today. That'd be pretty cool, wouldn't it? Whoop. And then we'll head right here, and that's where you're going to do that. Let's get rid of this John Deere so you guys can see everything that we're going to be starting with because we have a few pieces of equipment. But first, I'm stuck. Let's check out the main house. It's spinning. Everything is spinning. Let's go. Be cool if there's a person at the desk. That's a little bit harder to do than you would think. It does, but my network exists. There you go. All right, so here is your house. Totally enterable. Everything works. There you go. John Deere right there. Not a whole lot of case. You're not going to find it on here. Let's open up the front door and let's go inside. So in here, we have the bathroom. This door right here is going to go out to the garage. So you do have your garage here. Ooh, let me back in. There we go. A little tight. And here you've got a nice office. You got farming simulator on the computer. Gotta have farm sim on the computer. What's my favorite tractor? Ooh, that's a good question. Maybe the John Deere, or not John Deere, uh, the Massey Ferguson 8700S, the mod that just released. I think so. JZM, thank you for $2 super chat, bro. Nice couch. Just be careful, don't fall over. <laughs> you got your kitchen upstairs. Ooh, chickens in with some potatoes and everything. That looks good. Yeah. This is your kitchen area. Pretty cool little area. I like that they've taken the time to actually make things on the inside. Let's see. Anything uh, interesting? Ooh, check this out. This looks to be... Oh, I don't know what map that is. That might be this map. But that is... Uh, what was that? Giant's Editor. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Oh, man, that's awesome. All right, let's head back downstairs. Got another little bedroom down here. Uh, and that is it. That is your indoor house. The entire house is doable. Now, one thing I didn't check. Let's check this real quick. Sleep trigger. Uh, let's see. No sleep trigger there. No sleep trigger there. Let's head upstairs. Uh, no slip trigger through here. Does the house show up on the map? The house does not show up on the map. So it looks like there's no sleep trigger allowing you to make your own, which is pretty cool. Uh, what I what I would recommend is the sleeping mat. So we're going to go in here. And the AJ Tech farmhouse. Oh, only one allowed for farm. Well, I wonder where you sleep. <laughs> Wait, Bull, I don't know where to go to bed. <laughs> Let's check out the cow pasture right here. This map will be for all platforms. It is not out yet. It's a first look map tour type thing. This is where your animals are. Of course, you can do 400 cattle. 400 head of cattle. Do whatever you want through there. Also, we are seasons ready, so that is a good thing. Uh, and then, of course, food going over the sides. We have a light right here. Turn the light on. Yeah, we've got some light inside now. So that's how everything's gonna go. You have your cattle, which will be in here as well. Very, uh, I don't know. Where's Gore's Farm? Watch Farm Sim News. I don't think you can actually drive in here. Of course, there would be no reason to drive in here anyway. Yeah, there's no reason to drive in there. All of your access points are outside, which is very nice. Now, oh no, <laughs> oh boy. You've got this area right here. I believe this is for your straw. And oh, getting chopped in half there. Let's let's get out of there because that's that's a little bit dangerous. So that's that. Oh, we got a little something over here. What do we got? Chickens. Yeah, got some chickens right here. Four hundred chickens total. And of course, this is where all your food and everything's gonna go. And then your hmm, I'm not sure where the eggs go. We'll have to find out whenever we start playing on this map a little bit. Coming around, of course, you've got your silo. We talked about the silo. Let's, well, we opened this up already, didn't we? We could open this up again. You've got a door and a way in, so you've got that. You're Applebee's lunchtime. You make me jealous over here. There you go. There's your combine right there. Again, another drive through garage, so you could store lots of stuff in there. It's a very, very nice, to say the least. 
There is one thing that is leased, the John Deere 7R. Now, I don't know if it's going to stay like that, but for now, <clears throat> it is there. Favorite mod, the search mod. A hundred percent, I can search for whatever I want. Oh yeah. Uh, what's this, an early DJ live stream? And ooh, a map that looks awesome, yes. Hey, William Taylor, as always. Much love, brother. Let's get a hashtag for William up in the chat. Ooh, eating the Outback? Y'all making me hungry, and I just had lunch. You got some more buildings right here, as we showed off at the beginning of the live stream. Just places, store stuff. Nice, tall, open. Put whatever you want. Very good to go. And, of course, we showed you guys these as well. These are all bunker silos, so do whatever you want to. Make tons and tons and tons of silage, and do your thing. Right here, you've got your hayloft. Now, we just do hay, or we'll do other things as well. Let's take a look. Do hay and straw, and it will do 400,000 liters of it. Uh, you sent me a message on my messenger page, Danny. I'll take a look after the stream's over. That's where you're going to get it out. This is where you pick it up. Anything fancy? Hopefully not. Nope, nothing fancy. Works exactly the way you would expect it to. Again, straight through here. A very nice, long, open shed. You would be surprised how many people take for granted the fact that like how useful these are just going straight in pull your vehicles through close the door open the doors go straight out boom there you go and again that is it for your main farm right here pretty nice i really really like this let's take a look at the pda again for those of you that are just joining us this is your pda right here at least to start with a new farmer you don't get a whole lot but of course you know you do have a hundred thousand dollars so you could go in and possibly buy a few areas. Um, again, uh, White Bull Mine, if you guys are watching, some of these are a little bit priced differently. For example, four and five, $819,000, but only 135 for that one. Maybe it'll stay that way, maybe it won't. You never know. <laughs> New farmer here, number three days. Got inspired by the Goham fan. There you go, Jesse, what's up, man? Oh, back in school. Yeah, I do stream a little bit earlier, but it's because so many great streamers stream in the evening and nighttime. I don't even have time to get in there. So I try to stream early, let you guys check it out. Anything uh, new? Nope, nothing new with that. My my advice with anything like this, check farm some news. And if I didn't talk about it, well, there's just not anything in there. Still have to fix some things. Yeah, but that's all right. You know what? The layout is great. This is what I was actually going to do for the thumbnail right here. But I decided last second, I was like, you know what? We got to show off the windmill. We got to show off that again. Everything works perfectly fine. Pretty cool. So, what are... Oh, BGA. A lot of you guys do BGA stuff. Let's check the BGA out. You should be very familiar with this BGA. The style, the layout, the setup. It should be very, very similar to things that you used to. Mr. Paul Sterling. Hey, oh, the fist. Oh, bump. Yeah. Bro fist time. Let's go. <laughs> hey, Paul with the $3 super chat. Much love, brother much much love so you've got tons of area around here you may even be able to do more silage at your main farm than you do at the bga the good thing is if you do it's just right here you don't have to go far very very cool um the map is i and i mentioned this to white bull mining i love the main farm layout it allows you to get in and out fairly easily from any direction plus the fields i think i expected maybe there just to be more stuff and there's already a lot of stuff on the map, but one thing I like, and I, I took a step back, I was like, ooh, ooh, is the absolute massive size of these fields. These are huge. This is a full 2X map, by the way. So this is the same size as Felsbrunn, Ravenport, Sandy Bay, uh, you name it, if it's on console, it's this size. And it's a full size map. These, these fields are absolutely massive. So you're going to be able to take full advantage of the field sizes to do massive, massive harvests. I did not miss Paul's Super Chat. I just saw it. <laughs> Ursa Forest Vlogging. Yes, uh, we talked about those momentarily, but we will come back through. We also have something else to show you guys down there as well. All this. You do get a landing pad, so you've got a landing pad right there. Kind of uh, regroup yourself. Coming through here, as you can see, We've got roads. We have a couple extra landing pads in there for you guys as well. And if we go way, way up in the air, you get to see exactly how many is in here. Now, one thing that people doing logging 
will ask questions about is DJ, are there trees that you can't get rid of? Because sometimes you guys now, sometimes you have like a bush or sometimes you'll have like these little trees that you just can't get rid of them. You're not going to find that here. You will find smaller trees like this size, but you could still cut them down perfectly fine. Uh, Marksville is not coming to Mod Hub. No, he has mentioned that about a billion times. Um, so there's nothing, nothing in here that's going to get you. Oop, we got a floater. <laughs> uh, White Bull, if you guys are watching, let's see. Where am I? Okay, I'm on the right hand side right there. Go like straight right of field seven and that's where the live floater is. That's all right. Uh, with so many trees in here, but it's cool. Yeah, it's gonna be for all platforms, but it's really nice. It, you've got just trees straight up. So there you go. Marksville's very heavy. Yeah, Marksville's even having some, some issues on PC as well. It's a good, uh, good map. Funny enough, it was like the day I downloaded Global Company. I was like, I'll try Marksville Global Company. And it didn't load. I was like, oh man. <laughs> Like, this is why I don't use Global Company. But you've got multiples of those. So you've got over there. you got over here. Yeah, get the NMC dozer in here. Poof, 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 poof. Hello, Polly County. Congratulations. I have not been able to uh, send a message to you, by the way. But congratulations, bro. Let's take a look at this. Let's head back down to the ground. What do we have right here? What do you guys think it is? Let's take a look. Boop. Our sheep pasture. Just right here. Let's jump down to the ground. We'll take a little bit of a look. How about that? Whoop. Come right there. Open up. Everything's looking good. We'll come inside. Here you have places for food, places for water. Nice area for sheep, isn't it? Uh, Polly Count, I have not forgot about you. I promise I've just been way, way too busy today. I've been ahead of schedule, if anything. 250 head of sheep course as you know you could place other things down as well now here's something that a lot of you guys may overlook may not know about there is an animal pack pen these guys right here the like open pastures you could take these take a whole one and bring it over here in these of course i don't own the land but you could take like maybe beside it over here place that down now You've got everything. No slot counts are available at the moment. Boop. There you go. What do you guys think about that? Any questions about the map so far, at least from where we are at? What's up, Sniper Kill? Good to have you in here, as always. Season support. Yes. Yeah. Uh, you'll be um, you'll be hard pressed to find a map that does not support seasons straight out of the gate anymore. What type of mods can you get on Xbox? Whatever you want. Check out, go on Xbox, go to mods, and just have a search around. Map will be coming to all platforms. Yes. Precision farming? I do not know. Um, I don't have precision farming in, downloaded, and I have not tried to use it on here. So that's one thing I'm not sure about. Jack Steer, welcome to the Go Ham Fam. Check the community tab, Jack. I have opened my Discord up to channel members. We got everything there. Seasons ready? Yes. Uh, what's the difference between follows and likes on Facebook? I don't know, man. I don't know anything about Facebook. <laughs> I just know I need 10,000 in one of them. That's all I know. Crop textures, they're all the same. As far as I can tell, they're all the same. We'll come out here and we'll uh, we'll start adding some crops in a field and we'll see what we get. Be good for lawn care setup. Yeah, this is going to be a really cool setup for lawn care. You do have big rolling hills and you do have... Um, non-square fields actually there's not a single square field on here like field five might be the squarest field but it's still not perfect so as you can see no square fields so if square fields is your thing you might be slam out of luck for that one looks like a pc map but for all platforms how awesome mg gaming has it right there couldn't have said it better myself let's go in here let's first off let's see if f11 even works <laughs> Let's find out. We are in field four. Let's go with wheat. Uh, it's not the field we're in. We're in field five. There we go. Uh, wheat looks kind of custom. Is that the wheat texture? It does look pretty good though, doesn't it? I like it. Let's check out barley. 
Field five. Oop, that is oats. Boop. There's your barley texture. These do look different. They do look different. Much, much different. Oh, hey, White Bull Mining is premiering their preview of this in 30 minutes, which actually will be done with the stream by then. Um, yep. Yeah. You can fly a truck in here. Yes, absolutely you can. Sassy Farmer, good to see you in here. Um, let's see. Next up, Oats. See what we get there. That's Field 4. You know what? Let's just go to Field 4. <laughs> There's Oats. These have to be custom. These don't look anything like the ones that we normally do. What microphone do I recommend with a headphone pass-through for under 70 bucks? Uh, none of them. <laughs> very hard to recommend in that area i would say probably um yeti any kind of yeti that you can get honestly yetis are great just don't get the uh, snowball because that's pfft. anything else corn's custom yeah the cotton looks to be normal let's see canola real quick we'll take a look at it that's normal canola some flowers. Those are pretty normal. Maybe I'm just not used to being this close to the crops. But wait, did I do eight, seven? No, yeah, I did seven. Soybean six, five, four. Okay, yeah. Those are those are soybeans. Those look very different. Yeah, these look very different. I didn't even think about that. Corn? You said corn? We'll double check that. Yeah, that's different right there. That is very, very different. So, custom, uh, finally, it's being textured on Mod Hub. There you go. Yeah, these are, these are quite different from anything that we've seen. Yes. Uh, potatoes? Sure, why not? We just got a potato DLC. Oh, I think all of these are different. Because that's not what we normally see. It looks like we have 100% normal crop textures on here. Or not normal, but 100% custom, or at least different crop textures. Beets, yeah, that's different. Look how these move when I move through them. That's so cool. Hey, let's open this up. Uh, Neil, I got you, fam. Here we go. We'll check this out. I don't, I don't, I don't know what these look like normally, so I don't know. <laughs> Uh, I think that's it, right? Poplars. You guys love poplars. Uh, I think I broke it because it is not doing it. Let's do that. And then poplars. Poplars are not showing up. Yikes. Uh, white bull, double check and make, make sure poplars work. Hey, and that's very custom grass. There you go. I like it, man. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. What do you guys think? That's pretty cool. That alone might be worth the map's weight in gold. It's just having custom textures like that. That's pretty nice. Trucker, good to see you, brother. How is everything going in Trucker Matsy's world today? Not like. Yeah. It's good. Jack, happy almost birthday, man. Birthday's in a couple days. We will not be streaming on your birthday on Saturday, but we will be streaming on Friday, and I can make this announcement because you guys are in here with me right now. This week's guest here on YouTube, on my channel, we will be streaming the Farm Sim Show Friday, I think at 2 or 3 o'clock Eastern time, will be Mr. Sealy P. With Clutch Simulations and myself, we're going to be uh, interviewing him we're going to be interviewing him about, uh, well, just everything YouTube. So there you go. All right, let's jump back in. <laughs> Excuse me. So that's going to be very exciting. So we showed all of that off toothpaste truck. <laughs> so what else do you guys want to see? What do you want to know about the map? Uh, release dates and things like that. Uh, there is no answer for those questions. And as far as platform... All of them. Thought I was gonna live stream before. Yep, you thought I was gonna live stream before, but I mentioned in the text or the first pin comment of the mod video and inform some news. It'd be earlier, so always check the uh, always check pinned comments in those videos. That'll give you all the extra information that you'll need. 
streaming March 18th? Uh, I don't know. I could tell you maybe. Let's take a look. March 18th? That is a Thursday. No, I do not stream on Thursdays. All platforms? Yes. Didn't I just say that? Friday's gonna be fun. Truck Club mod was cool. That's that. That's in like my top 25. Like every map that you have, you have to have that. Am I still a DJ? Man, I hadn't really been a DJ for like a year. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, the 18th is your birthday. Well, I will probably stream either the day before or the day after for sure. <coughs> 24th October? I don't know, man. I could... Uh, things may be different by then. You never know. Let's see. Can you sell all the equipment? See how much money you get from that. Uh, that The equipment and things like that, probably not final. Uh, what I can tell you is you get big equipment to start with. You get a John Deere 8RT. You get the Roadrunner. The S790. You get a Chrome Big X. You get a huge mixer right there. 17,000 liters. Wheel loader, pickup, you get a pace setter, big header. Um, not a corn header, but you do get a crop header. You also have a cultivator, cedar, manure spreader, big baler, high dump bucket, header trailer, cow pasture, horse paddock. So all these can be sold. You don't have to have them on here if you don't want to. Hayloft, three bunker silos. Um, so those of you that were asking, can you sell the farm? Yes. Yes, you can. You can sell all of this and create your own farm. Possibly even, we should definitely check this. What does the house look like? We'll just check the house. Okay, it says uh, Hisa. Take a look real quick and see if we can buy it. And if we can, we know that the placeables are able to put down as well. Mm, yep. So we could place down all these placeables. That's cool. We talked about that in Farm Sim News earlier today, talking about Messy B and asking, would you guys like to see that on more maps? And I mean, it was an overwhelming yes, for sure. I take Farm Sim Show. <laughs> there you go. Uh, what's going on with the 9X? Nothing. Nothing going on with the 9X. Uh, nobody's ever said anything about a 9X. Custom crack textures. Yep. Every single one of them looks like. My next is coming to console. I haven't seen anything about that. <laughs> it's a map American? Yeah. Maze Plus, uh, this is a all platform map. There will not be different versions for everything. So will Maze Plus work? Yes, but it is not Maze Plus ready. X9. Ah, that's what you're talking about. Ah, he's working on it. Yeah. Excellent. Nothing to see here. Yep. That work for FS19. <laughs> uh, giant Software are the ones that made the, the game, Farming Simulator. Um, I am a Giants uh, partner. I am a Giants uh, media partner. Giants ambassador. Uh, if there was a list, all the boxes would be checked. <laughs> and a silver partner as well, which is pretty cool. So, can you see the map with the fields? Yeah, there you go. That's it right there. What you see that is highlighted, that is New Farmer right there. Boop. Okay, 100 foot enclosed trailer. Goodness gracious. That's that's a little bit large. That's a little bit large. I think that might be a little bit too big. Uh, Zachary, no. Um, if you guys use the codes for, um, like when we do DLCs and games, things like that, um, in those cases, yes, we do get a um, we do get a commission off of those sales, which costs you nothing extra. All it does is go to help support the creators. Everybody has those, by the way. So myself, Virtual Farmer, A2 Studio, all those guys, we've all got them. So if you if you've got a favorite YouTuber and you want to support them directly without having to spend anything extra yourself, and you got to buy something for Farm Sim, that's the easiest way to do it. It doesn't have to be me. Just go sport somebody, that's all. John Deere in the store starts spinning at the touch of a mouse. Get out of here! Aye, right, we about to go check that out real quick. I right, hold up. You telling me this is about to be cool? Is that what you're telling me right now? There's no release dates for mods. I don't know how many times I can say that out loud. But there's no release dates for mods. <laughs> Dexter, I appreciate you. Thank you for liking the Facebook page. That helps a lot. A whole line. 
Oh, here we go. Go, 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 go. Hey. Alright, that's cool. <clears throat> Sid has never made a map. What you guys think about that? Ooh. Yeah, that's cool. I'm alright with that. And it's console controller friendly as well. Yeah. Yeah, I'll take that. Can you do beef cattle? There's only one cow farm and it does everything. So there's a full, uh, need some disco lighting. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. All right, let's go ahead. Oh, yo, hold up. If you hit it again, it spins the other way. Get, get out of here. Let's hit it again. And then we hit it again. What? Stop. Stop it. That's awesome. All right. So it looks like this isn't something that will start on its own. ADHD dream. You're right. Um, but you can turn it on and make it spin in any direction. I wonder if... So if we go here over to the main farm, sometimes things like this will stop. So we hit that. And then we go back. Where is it? It's in here, I thought. Uh, animal, oh, that's the wrong side of the map. I, my head's all turned around. We go back to the shop. Is it still spinning? She's still spinning. That's pretty cool, man. That is pretty cool. Can I do role play? My role play is awful. It's just bad. <laughs> I'm not being self-critical. I'm being honest. It's terrible. Uh, let's see. 18, uh, Bricka one with the $20. He says, nice to see more American map. Hello from Norway. I hope everything is going well your way. Thank you very, very much. That is really cool of you. Let's go and get these bad boys closed up. So I think, at least, let me teach you. I don't want to do role play, man. I just, I'll just talk about news and mods and I'll be done. <laughs> so there you go. And starts carrying trucks and telling handlers. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing wrong with that at all. How many mods do I have? Uh, 300 or 3,000 some. Pickle, I love you, bro. Silo capacity, 400,000. Oh, actually, it's 1 million. The main silo is 1 million. Even better. <clears throat> Even better. What's up, Taz? You need a bajillion times map? <laughs> Actually, so a uh, thousand mile per hour tractor? No, no, giants would say LOL or they wouldn't respond at all. Um, that's just, they're just not gonna, case lives matter too, but deer is better though. No. <laughs> uh, PC can't even handle, ah, oh, I'm not gonna say that out loud. Get out of here. Um, so there you go, yeah, yeah. All right, what decks do I have for DJing? I have a uh, Pioneer DDJSX2, DDJSX3, and a DDJ1000 SRT. Yeah, and I'm selling all but the uh, DDJSX3. So if anybody wants an SX2 or a DDJ1000, hit me up. Uh, the SX2 is pretty rough, and one of the buttons doesn't work. You have to clean it out. The, SR, or the 1000 SRT is brand new. Like, brand new. It's one of the first 100 that were ever sold. But I haven't used it. I took it for one gig. Take it to the waterfall area. We'll go there right now. And then we are going to end the stream with something special from A2 Studio. Now, this is not a mod that I think will be sent off anywhere. Done anything with. Skipper Gaming, take it easy. Oh, oh what is DJ Goham talking about? Uh, I talk a lot of smack. What you talking about? What you talking about? <laughs> there you go. There is your uh, waterfall area. Get it pretty basic, pretty standard, but back up. Beautiful. That is a pretty look right there. Trucker, get out. <laughs> Take yourself home. All right. Now it is time to switch. Um, we will be streaming for about the next five minutes or so. So hang tight. If you want to see something go a million miles an hour. Um, 
I want to thank, I want to take this opportunity to thank White Bull Modding for sending over this map for an early look. We will be doing more with this map, so today's not the only day you're going to be seeing this. But I wanted to share this with you as soon as possible. White Bull Modding were extremely quick in getting this over, and were very gracious to basically say, Hey, you know, show this off, do a series, live stream, whatever you want to do. So today would not be possible without White Bull Modding. I couldn't do this without them. So I think a big shout out and a big hashtag for WBM or White Bull Modding would be awesome because these guys are the best. They really are. Um, so thank you, thank you, thank you to them for sending us over. And let me know what you want me to do with this as well. If you guys are watching this in, uh, in the future, in the uh, comments below, let me know what you want to see with this map. I'm happy to show you anything. Do whatever you want it. Now, White Bull Modding, if you don't, if you don't like unrealisticness, you might want to turn away. <laughs> because we're going to be having a little bit of fun. First off, got to get out of here. And we're going to load up into Farm Sim. We'll go go for a uh, large camera. We'll hang out for a minute. Also, do you like the red light right there? I like that red light right there. It breaks, breaks up the front and the back of myself. We're going to load back into Farm Sim. We are going to load into... Um, a map. <clears throat> I can't really figure out what the flattest one I can think of is. Red light space. Get out. <laughs> um, but I've got that, and then I've got blue lights over there, and then you probably saw we have a well, it's purple, but it's uh, was it? I don't know. It's my color. It's Farm some news color, whatever that is. It's that that purple blue color. It's nice. Carrying trucks with telehandlers. Oof. Are you using that, uh, the lightweight, the weight that just released yesterday? Also, go download that if you don't have it already, because that thing's awesome. Let's jump in here real quick. I don't think there's, I don't think there's anything in here that you can't see. Oh, I hope not. If so, I'm getting a lot of trouble. Also, let's have a little bit of coffee. If you guys are drinking some coffee, cheers. <sighs> Very delicious. A2 Studio, which map would be the best for this? A2 Studio sent over something a little bit ridiculous. I think... Uh, let's go over to Wild West 16X. I don't have that installed. So, also, guys were asking me the other day about... Oh, you guys are right here. You were asking me the other day about the map with, like, the, the bumps and the testing area. This is the one right here. Alsalsic Agri Farm. Um, this is by FSH Modding. Those guys do a really, really good job. Uh, let's see. Not Lone Oak. Wouldn't be mod... To, actually, mod test map wouldn't be bad. It's not bumpy. But I think... Oh, and that's what Rich Boy looks like. Pretty cool, huh? Man, they did such a good job with that map. Let's go over to Stone Valley. 4X. I think this is the only 4X map that I've got installed. Let's jump in here. And let's see this. Welker Farms? Oh, man, that would have been a good one. Yeah. I don't think I have Welker Farms installed either, though. That's the problem. But, yeah, that is definitely a good one. This this will be this will be good. We'll buy the whole map and then we'll build a little ramp. We're going to do what we do. If you hate the way I do the way I do, you may want to click off now. Like you said, 3 p.m. Eastern. <laughs> I did, but then I posted and said earlier. Check the pinned comments of the videos. I always post updated stuff there. You gotta go with me. <laughs> you gotta go through with me when I turn everything off. To buy anything. Now we have to go down to Global Company and turn that off. Yes, I have Global Company installed. Of course I have it installed. Ugh. I'm not happy about it, but you guys made me do it. I should make mods. I should not make mods. Um, we should leave mod making up to the professionals like A2 Studio, who will be streaming in almost exactly three hours. So, check him out. He is in here with us right here. There he is right there. Um, actually... Can we get A2 Studio in here with us? Um, Mr. A2 Studio, would you be so kind as to entertain everyone with your voice and talk about um, whatever you have put together for me? Shoot me a phone call on Discord. 
and we will uh we will have some fun how about that kurt barker welcome to i say welcome to the channel you are red that is that is completely different than the new member to the channel uh let's turn off the oh precision I said i had, didn't have download i didn't have it turned on i apologize for that seasons we got to turn that off because that's just gonna hurt everything going on right here seasons seasons and then the last one to turn off is straw me here we go a2 studio a2 studio up in a building baby yeah yeah here we are <laughs> So, how are you doing? I'm good, man. I'm good. If you guys are curious, this is A2 Studio, the creator of the TLX uh, 2020, the Moet Jack Moose, the TLX 9000, and something new that you have said to me. What have you done? Um, your thing, but <laughs> with with uh, control. Uh, he says it's uh, control. Or, uh, you yeah, you'll, you'll see. You'll, you'll, you cannot <laughs> drive it until you uh, until you are going to use it. Yeah, that's the deal. See, that's what I'm worried about. That alone is what I'm worried about. But you can drive to somewhere and then use uh, the store deliveries to wherever you are. Yeah, I, I know I could do that. And let me get rid of a bunch of stuff real quick. If you guys want to see the fastest vehicle that I think I've ever seen, I actually don't know yet. We're gonna find out. I know that much. <laughs> <laughs> it is the fastest I've seen. Uh, it's not letting me delete large silo extension. Urgh. Lancy boy, can't because delete, it, can't delete the silo extensions. <laughs> it has crops. Uh huh. That would be it. Let's go ahead and buy everything because we have to. Yo, everybody, chat. Hello, hello, hello. We got the man himself in here. I'll tell you what. Um. I was talking to David earlier today, and we were talking, well, I was talking about how some some Rs you see, and they make great mods, right? Some Rs you see, and they make mods that you're like, what? We've always needed this. Why did we not have this this whole time? And then there's some people that make stuff, and you're like, that's not what I asked for. This is better. A2 Studios, one of those guys that works his batuti off to make the <laughs> best mods possible. He works time when he should be sleeping, time when he should be spending with his family, time that he takes aside so that we can have the best possible enjoyment just playing a video game. And so while we've got you right here, you're right there. You know what? Put you over here. Now you over there. David, A2 Studio, A2 Square Studio, crap. Uh, Pranzio, however you say that. I'm not going to translate it because it's... <laughs> no, 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 no. Thank you for everything that you do for the community. Because you do a whole lot, whether you know it or not. I was talking, actually, with one of one of the souls this morning, with Pete. Uh, uh, he's a newsman, he, Pete Spittler. And he was, like, saying something like that. Like, thank you, thank you. And, and I was... Uh, Pit is actually the people who spoils me to do that. It's actually the people supporting and stuff like that actually helps keep keep going. So it's actually thanks to the thanks to the people. What have you break? <laughs> I broke it. It's I broke it a little bit, just a little bit. <laughs> I've got seven minutes. You loaded too many mods. I what no? No, you loaded too many mods. I just sent you one. <laughs> We're going to go into my test map. We're not going to be able to get this as fast as I want, but um, we'll... Oh, yeah, go to Pacific Northwest. You have, I believe you have plenty of space there. Yeah, there, there's enough space to get this up to a little bit. Drag Race Semi, I, I think this would be outlawed in the drag, sim, the drag world. Yeah. Do a public multiplayer stream. The last time I tried that, no farming got done. Everybody just messed with me the whole time. Well, uh, hang on. This one's for the uh, stream. Crash counter plus one. There you go. I knew we'd do something eventually. Hi. I mean, if we, I, I was saying that the other day. People like to break stuff. If everything goes according to the plan, mm -hmm. it, it's boring. But if the thing, I mean, when I'm modding, when I made a mistake and I put something on the store and the thing blows up in the store, 
people enjoys it. It's like, ha, ha, ha. People, people is having fun <laughs> when things go wrong. And, and it's like, I'm trying my best to make this thing work. And people, if it goes, it's like, yeah, ha, that's cool. It worked. If it doesn't, it does way weird stuff. Then people enjoys it. It's crazy, it's, it's isn't just, it? Yeah, it is. It is. It is crazy indeed. All right, let's oh find God. ourselves a Titan X. Also, if you're curious how I'd go so fast, so I use the Logitech G502. I have four of them. I have one on each of these PCs. I have one for my Mac right here. And then I have another one on the farm, some new setup back there. The best mice I've ever used. Go get one. They're like, I don't know. Uh, I'm sorry. I couldn't, I couldn't agree with that. MX Logitech MX Ergo is the first, is the best thing ever done. Well, at least we both like Logitech and that one I'll take. Yeah. No, but mine is a trackball. Ah, uh, see, that's going to work great for what you do. I actually do, yeah. or for editing, I used to use a trackball until I got the uh, Magic Mouse, which I really like. Actually, oh, I, have the, three, I have three different mice connected to the Mac. <laughs> yeah. I use them no. for different stuff. All right. Uh, let's see. We're in, which means we need to go reset our Preset point. one. Preset one. All right. Wait. Agro tires and last option, Agro three, at least. I'm scared. I'm really scared. Get no, hype. No, I'm, not, like no, I'm, I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not scared at all. I'm hype. All right, let's put it over here. This is far enough away. Yeah, no. So this is the Titan X. Of course, I don't think anyone will ever see this. Is that correct? Uh, no. No, that's just for your craziness. Preset one, no, to the right. Okay, right. that's it. There you go. Now, wheel brand aggro tires left on the wheel brand left aggro mm -hmm. and the last and aggro three. The third, the last option because it has more wheelbase. There you go. Now, the engine Titan X. Oof. That's about it. Yeah, only that. Oh boy. You can put it blue if you want. Oh. <laughs> Man, really? I keep forgetting to change the... You guys have not had game volume this entire stream. Has nobody said anything? Come on. Mike, Mixer, well, I Channel just listened to Discord, so I really cannot say it. All right. Music's off. Truck's on. Four million eleven thousand nine hundred sixteen mile per hour max speed. Just go? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just try to go straight. Oh, boy. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Help! Oh! Crash counter plus one. Told you, not enough map. Oh, you can drive backwards. Look at that. Oof. Oh. A little bit. <laughs> I'm creeping. Hey, there's another TLX over there. Oh, we should definitely unhook that trailer. <laughs> <laughs> this was from like two videos ago. I've still got it here because I keep forgetting to save the it. Picture of the of the video. Yep, that was actually the thumbnail that was set up. The thumbnail, yeah. Y yeah, we the trailer. <laughs> the trailer is gonna fly. <laughs> it's not heavy enough. And it's gone. Oh, land it! I did not. So yeah, you need flat area, <laughs> flat, flat area. I've been able to put it at to 14, 1400 miles per hour. Ooh, lock the wheels. Yeet. Flat map. Yeah, a little bit. Hang on real quick before we have to end, which I think is going to be soon. Don't own this land. This is my test map. I, give me everything. Come on. Da -da 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 -da. I need to scoot flat now, now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Sculpting flat. Go, go, go. How you did it so fast? I'm so fast. All right. We'll just make this flat, and then we're going to do a yeet ramp right at the end. Uh, <laughs> speaking of A2 Studio, what you doing in your live stream later on today? <laughs> uh, animals. Uh, we're ooh. going to... Yeah, we're going to try to progress on the animal trailers 
Yes. Yeah, that should be good. Yeah. <laughs> you get to see me. Oh, I find out in County Line, the the map of PC only. Uh huh. Uh, you can you can actually uh. It has the the highest difference in between ground and sky. Oh. And you could go crazy with with well with what you do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need to go too high. I just need it to work just good enough. That's all we need. So yeah. if you guys are curious how you do this, the higher you want to get your uh, jump, the more upwards you want to do this. Now, this works the best if you just do like a small little yay right there. Uh, <laughs> I think that's how you pronounce it. Uh, but, you, but you want to make this as smooth as possible. So you kind of want to just like sit there and just hold it on it and then it should be good but you do want just enough area through here where there's a nice smooth how do we gain 100 people watching since i started doing this <laughs> yeah Welcome. i told you when you when you break up people enjoys it where are you going with the trailer just, i haven't tried it with the trailer I tried with the low boy and a dozer behind, and I've been able to put it 600 miles. 300, 400, yay! Teet, 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 teet. <laughs> oh, it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> you can just see he's like, what? Oh. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, to the moon. Gonna put that controller back down. Uh, well, on that bombshell. Oh, it's together! Hey, we came back! Oh, but it's gone again. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, DJ broke the game. Again. <laughs> again, yeah. Oh, it's, uh, you should we, say again. We found the water. All right, well, streams always end that way, don't they? I hope you enjoyed today. AG Studio, thanks for jumping in here with me. I appreciate it, My brother. Pleasure. Uh, thank you very, very much to White Bull Mining. Again, without them, we would not have been able to show you this awesome map. I hope you're as excited about it as I am. If you are, make sure you drop a like. Smooth segue. Make sure you get subscribed to the channel if you're not already. Join the Go Ham Fam channel members. Get access to the Discord and not one, but two custom servers if you guys want to check that out. That is really cool. Uh, for everybody else, that is it for today. I'll see you tomorrow. We're going to do the same stuff tomorrow. Uh, no live stream tomorrow. We'll be back on Friday with Farm Sub Show with Mr. Sealy P. Very exciting. No streams this weekend. Uh, just a, like Farm Sub News and then like a second video Saturday and Sunday. It is the Super Bowl weekend. So I'm taking some time off. I'm enjoying some football. We're going to hit the ground running next week full time. But between now and then, hope you have a great day. Big hugs, big loves, the elite. Everybody love everybody. It's super early. No excuse not to do something nice for somebody. And if you need something nice done for you, don't be afraid to ask. We're all here for each other. Hope you have a great day. We'll see you later. Peace. Hey, AT Studio. What's up, dude? <laughs> Shut up. How you, how you doing, man? You feeling good? <laughs> see, okay. Yeah, I'm doing good. Freaking bot. That's a fast track. Track, 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 track. Yeah, track. Track, track, track. Yeah.